closed. Great. Mm. And I will bet you, you don't have a warrant to get in. Hmm? Darn it. It's a bummer. You wasted the day on purpose. Madam, I have a fake badge. I would never impede your pretend investigation. It's not a pretend investigation. Look, see? See him? This otter is missing. Well, then they should have gotten a real cop to find him. What is your problem? Does seeing me fail somehow make you feel better about your own sad, miserable life? It does, 100%. Now, since you're sans warrant, I guess we're done? <sighs> Fine. We are done. Here's your pen. Hey! First off, you throw like a bunny. Second, you're a very sore loser. See you later, Officer Fluff. So sad, this is over. I wish I could've helped more. The thing is, you don't need a warrant if you have probable cause, and I'm pretty sure I saw a shifty lowlife climbing the fence. So you're helping plenty. Come on. 219HT03, this is it. Oh my god! What? What? The velvety pipes of Jerry Vole. <sighs> but on CD? Who still uses CDs? <laughs> Carrots? If your otter was here, he had a very bad day. Those are claw marks. Have you ever seen anything like this? No. Wait, look. This is him, Emmett Otterton. He was definitely here. What do you think happened? Well, now, wait a minute. Polar bear fur, rat pack music, fancy cup. I know whose car this is. We gotta go. Why? Whose car is it? The most feared crime boss in Tundra Town. They call him Mr. Big, and he does not like me, so we gotta go. I'm not leaving. This is a crime scene. Well, it's gonna be an even bigger crime scene if Mr. Big finds me here, so we're leaving right now. Raymond, and is that Kevin? Long time no see. And speaking of no see, how about you forget you saw me? Huh? For old time's sake? That's a no. wool rug that was made from the fur of a skunk. But... Oh, sweet cheese and crackers. 